This week is Metaverse Fashion Week, taking place for the second time, and it's even bigger this year in multiple Metaverse worlds, including Decentraland and Spatial. If you jump into it from any of those spaces, what you'll see is a curated digital three-dimensional world like a computer game in which you can navigate through different environments, see different clothing items that you can purchase as digital objects for your avatar. And it's really fascinating to me to think about why this exists. Why do people want to do this? I think to understand it, we have to do two things. Look at the history of cultural consumption. What sorts of things do people buy? and why do they do it? We've had a huge amount of consumption over the 20th century where we bought so many objects to the point where people sort of wonder what the point of it all is. Why do we need so many items of clothing? Why do we need to consume and consume until there's no end? And I think Metaverse Fashion Week responds to that in a number of ways. First, it gets us to think about the value, inherent value of objects and maybe ask the question that in fact we don't need the object at all, it's what it symbolises that matters to us. But also, as we grow closer and closer into digital experiences, we also find ourselves valuing digital currency above the actual physical objects. So it's more interesting to have an object we can put on our avatar as we play the game Fortnite than it is to walk around the streets in a new item of clothing that maybe isn't seen by anybody that we know. So there's a transformation of value attached to objects that the Metaverse Fashion Week symbolizes. This is why it's big. And it's also why it's the beginning of a whole new era of cultural consumption. Take a look at it. It's fascinating to jump into the space, see what's possible, and understand how brands are positioning themselves around these new digital environments.